What's your opinion of the future PMS? Is it should it even be called a PMS? Should it be called a hotel operating I, system or management system? I, I, I think we want to get away from the name PMS yeah. in general. I think uh, uh, you know we stick to the to the traditional acronyms because people looking for a product are trying to check a box, right? So we're trying to to hit those boxes, but mm. at the end of the day, it's not it's not. The same as the dozen dozens of PMSs that have existed, the legacy sort of thick client mm. systems out there, right? Mm. I think it comes back to analytics and data, mm. um, and how the data can be used to drive better decision making at the front desk, at the hotel, right? With rates and availability, right? With check-in experience, what's the time to check in? Um, how how does that relate to the booking engine, and how does that data come back into the system, right? If you have multiple properties, right? How do you optimize all of your your whole portfolio of properties, right? And I think um, we're seeing, you know, the 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 new age PMSs or whatever, w without using that acronym, right? But uh, th these PMSs are evolving into something that that is, I think, synonymous with business intelligence. Uh, whether it's another platform out there that you can connect to, whether mm -hmm. you can bring that data back into the P into the PMS. I think it's about decision making. Right? Totally. So. And to expand on what you said, traditionally you have different roles inside a hotel or inside a resort or in a B and B that were confined to their data source. They weren't they weren't sort of indoctrinated across all data that mm -hmm. could be meaningful yeah. Yeah. in helping their decision make. They might just see revenue management related data, but they're not seeing it as the big picture of you know, yeah, I know my guests, you know, my guest history of, of what comes in and goes. I know what rates are happening in the market, but I might not necessarily see how our front desk staff is allocating those rooms on certain days for, for gap reasons and, and whatnot. Mm -hmm. and, and so if we can de decompartmentalize data and create those same roles, meaning the different functions within a hotel inside the product, but then make everything available. One of the reasons Pi is so good is we flush to the surface all the things that you would need in three little boxes to make a decision around rate on a specific day. And that's unique to us right now. All these other wonderful teams bring all that information, but because the PMS is part of that core data set mm. and it's right there and it's seamless to all the other aspects of the application, it becomes really, really powerful and it makes decision making faster. Mm. But I think what we are trying to challenge our teams is we want to go further into workflow. We want to say, hey, every property does it different. Start automating your workflow, not our workflow, your workflow, in, in putting those workflows in a way that the system just starts doing things for them mm. in making some of those menial decisions mm -hmm. so that they can again go back to the guest, which I think yeah. is the most important part of it. I, I do. I think that that next step is workflow in terms of like kind of like what Slack has done for our company or what Slack is doing for companies out there. Like how do you, how do your teams communicate, right? How does what the front desk staff, staff is doing relate to housekeeping, relate to somebody, uh, customer experience or guest experience or e-commerce, right? These, all these teams have to talk together and they're kind of related mm -hmm. and they're all working on one mission, right? To create the best guest experience, right? To, to attract more guests and ultimately, you know, like more reservations, right? So I think it's, it's, uh, I think that's the next step, and and I think a PMS. I, I think ten years from now, hopefully, we're not even talking about a PMS yeah. anymore. Right. Mm. We're not talking about an IBE. Yeah. <laughs>